Coming up this week on LMTV at Excelsior. We'll give you a sneak peek inside the new 5th and 6th grade buildings. Another staff member steps into the staff spotlight. We'll have those stories and a whole lot more. LMTV at Excelsior is next. This is LMTV, Linmar Television. Excelsior, your news starts now. Welcome to LMTV at Excelsior. I'm CJ. And I'm Addie. Time now for today's top story. Taking a look into the future. LMTV's Luke explains. Linmar Superintendent Mr. Bisgard invited the public to the LRC to take a look at the designs for the two new intermediate schools. As you can see, they are two-story buildings that will be built next to Echo Hill Elementary and on 35th Avenue near 44th Street. Groundbreaking for the two buildings is set for later this year. Watch for updates here on LMTV as construction gets underway. Breaking news. Spring is coming. Sometime. The weather may not agree with us, but it is time to start thinking about spring sports. 7th and 8th graders can now sign up online for track, girls tennis, or boys soccer. See the Excelsior Athletic webpage for more information. Thanks, Danica. Now it's time for the PBS Point of Information for the Week. Here's LMTV's Kira. As we keep working on our goal to reduce our major behavior write-ups for the third quarter, let's talk about something else we could do to show responsibility and respect, especially in the hallways. If you have forgotten Excelsior, the cell phone rules include the following. At 7.55, all cell phones and electronic devices are to be turned off and put away until 2.45, or unless a teacher directs you that you may use your phone for classroom work. Keep earbuds and headphones packed away during passing time in the hallway. If you use your cell phone in class, it needs to be turned completely off. Earbuds or headphones need to be put away before you enter ha the hallway to pass to other classes. Earbuds hanging around your neck or still in your ears while passing in the hallway between 7.55 and 2.45 are not allowed. When the dismissal bell rings at 2.45, you may turn on your phone or electronic devices. Keep up the respect, responsibility, and integrity you've been showing in the hallways, Excelsior. Thanks for your attention to this week's PIS Point of Information Minute. Time for this week's Staff Spotlight. It's sixth grade science and tag teacher, Mrs. Spolstra. She loves singing and music, watching sports, vacationing in national parks. She adores her husband, Morgan. One thing on her bucket list is to snorkel in a cor coral reef. Congratulations, Mrs. Spolstra, for being in this week's Staff Spotlight. Thanks, Brooklyn. Now Manny and Howie are here with the LMTV Excelsior Sports Report. Tuesday, the wrestlers host Roosevelt and Southeast Junior High at Oak Ridge. Thursday, it's a meet that was rescheduled from last month. The wrestlers face McKinley and Reese's LaSalle at LaSalle. I'm Annie. And I'm Howie. That's this week's LMTV Excelsior Sports Report. Time for library news. Library Ex I Excel this week has a fun activity scheduled. On Thursday and Friday, you can come in and try Animoto. You can develop short digital videos that include music, photos, video clips, and text as well as the share their creations electronically. Come try it out. That's what's happening this week in the library. I'm Lucy in News from the Arts. Double Time Show Choir's last performance is tomorrow night at the high school. Ovation from Oak Ridge will be joining them at 6.30 p.m. Stay after for Root Beer Floats. That's the arts this week at Excelsior. I'm Jasmine. And I'm Madeline. Here what the lunch crew is cooking up this week here at Excelsior. Today it's chicken parmesan. Tuesday you'll love the French toast sticks. Wednesday, Wednesday it's beef nachos. Thursday try the pizza crunchers. And wrap up the week with a chicken patty sandwich on Friday. That's lunch this week at Excelsior. That's a wrap for this week's edition of LMTV at Excelsior. On behalf of the entire cast and crew, thanks for watching. See you next week.